we're trying to do here is to take you through the different harness mounting options that you get with your OpsCore Soder Special Operations Tactical Respirator. And you have three options for doing that. So first you have a head harness, a helmet harness, and a O2 mask strap. The way you're gonna get the soda out of the package is just like this. And the first thing you wanna do is attach the filter. And then can, you can start installing whatever harness you want. We'll start with the head harness. To install any harness, what you wanna do is choose one of the sides on the bottom of the mask and then start with one end or the other end of the harness and line it up with that strap. And then just work your way around snapping as you go until all the snaps are engaged. And at that point, your head harness is installed. So use the head harness. Put the mask on. Pull the flag out. And then you're good to go. So then if you want to install a different harness, like the helmet harness, you're just going to reverse the process. Start unsnapping. Put that aside. So again, I'm going to start in with one of the snaps, work my way around. until they're all attached. And now how do we want to mount it on the helmet? It's just going to use the Velcro on the straps to attach to the Velcro on the helmet and allow you to very quickly attach the mask. Okay, the last helmet harness option is the O2 strap harness. And this harness attaches the same way as the other ones, but uses the corner connectors on the arc rail to attach the harness to the helmet. And has the added advantage of a quick disconnect so that you can quickly disconnect the mask, let it hang, and then reattach it when you need it again, just using the fact sticks buckle. So those are the three harness attachment options for the Soder mask.